viewers uh, welcome to Texial. today I'm going to discuss two most commonly used terms uh, which are wrap content and mesh parent uh, whenever you design uh, any layout for the screen uh, it basically contains some layouts and some views so most of the time you require to set the width and height of these views and layouts so whenever uh, you are setting the width and height you most commonly use uh, the wrap content and match parents so let's discuss both of these and the differences between them so let's discuss the uh, activity main uh, xml that is written so if you see at the xml uh, so here is a linear layout which you can say is a root layout and it is covering the whole screen uh, it has a width and height of uh, height set to match parent uh, within this linear layout there is an other linear layout uh, this one and it has a width of 300 dp and height of 400 dp so this is this one uh, within this linear layout there is a single text view uh, which has a width and height both wrap content so let's first discuss what is wrap content whenever you set uh, the width or height of any uh, view or any layout to wrap content it means that the width and height of that layout should uh, be according to the content of that view for example here uh, for this text view the content of this text view is basically this text which is textial and if I change that content uh, let's say I write uh, YouTube so its content is increasing so as the content is increasing it is also expanding uh, its area uh, by the width uh, as, it, as the width is wrap content so its width is increasing as the content is increasing so this is basically wrap content means uh, the width and height uh, will be according to the content of the view or it may be a layout so uh, let's discuss what is match parent uh, for example if, if I change this width to the match parent now let's see what happens so I have set the width to the match parent basically match parents mean uh, to match with the width of uh, the parent of this view here the parent of this text view is basically this linear layout and this linear layout has a width of 300 dp and as I have set the width to the match parent so it has actually matched to the width of its parent which is 300 dp so here we can see that this this linear layout and this text we both have the same width now as uh, I have set it to the match parent now if I set the height also to the match parent then it should uh, actually match with the height of its parent so let's see so here if uh, you can see I have set the height to the match parent and its height is actually uh, increased and it is according to its parent which is this linear layout so both linear layout and text view have uh, the same width and height uh, which is actually 300 dp width and 400 dp height so this is actually the match parent to match uh, with the parent so if I see this linear layout I change its face to the match parent so now it has actually matched to the width of its parent which is actually this linear layout so this linear layout has matched its width to its parent which is this linear layout if I change the height now both the height and width of this linear layout is actually according to the width and height of this linear layout and now let's try something new for example I am changing this to the wrap content and this one wrap content so 
now the width and height of this linear layout is actually according to its content so for this linear layout the content is basically this text view so if i want to increase the content for example i add more text views uh, to this layout here so now it has two text views let's set this orientation for example i set it to the vertical so now you can see as the content is increased and uh, now it has two text views so its height is also wrapping uh, according to the content so uh, this is the basic difference between both match parent and uh, wrap content uh, basically in wrap content uh, the width and height will be according to the content of that view or that layout and in case uh, if you set the width or height to the match parent then the width and height of that view uh, will be according to the width and height of its parent uh, means uh, if uh, this is a linear layout it has some views inside it so for these views the parent is this linear layout and for this linear layout at it, as it is residing within this linear layout so this linear layout is actually the, uh, the parent of this linear layout so that's all for now i hope uh, you like the video so please don't forget to subscribe for more videos uh, thank you